okay so today we're going to um hack so stay here with me so as you can see i'm creating um my back door um, a payload which is going to act as a back door so um the target just only have to access um, this payload then um we are going to get a connection you see we are using a windows metaprinter and um, a reverse connection https meaning um the target can access um the payload on a web browser so um we are going to um, insert our ip address which is our l host so just um if config and um, we are going to find our ip address so that's my ip address so i'm using a virtual machine and i'm running cleanliness on it so it's like um i i the hacker um i'm using one machine just one computer so but the hacker can be anywhere so meaning the virtual machine is like another computer on this computer so um the hacker can be anywhere and um attack you so just um i'm just having one machine here so i'm running a virtual machine then um our l port and um we are done with our payload kill dot executable exe so um it's an executable payload and um the attack um the targets can download this payload then we're going to get a connection so i'm launching um msf console which is metasploit the background that we'll be using for hacking to receive them connection from our target computer so we're going to um do some settings here we're going to set up um our l port our port for hacking and um also our ip address so um we're going to set up everything here then our payload also because um um metasploit as a background um to receive a connection you have to specify er everything so um the ip address and um our ports and then the name of our payload um the platform of our payload which is windows metaprinter reverse underscore https then um we set up everything and um i think that's all so what you're going to do is um so for um your um ip address you just do if config and then there's your ip then we do exploit so we are waiting to receive a connection from our payload so um we're trying to um find locate um the payload we created um which is um kill dot exe so that's it so we copy it we move it to the server which is the server for kali apache 2 server and um we go to var then we go we look for um www html and that's it we create um a new folder then i name it payloads so payloads then we paste our payload here after that then um i'm starting the server so um we just do service apache 2 start so okay um it's loads it receives the command wait no error then we're good to go our server has started so it's running and um we can access it the target can access it so to access um our payload um our server is running so the target computer you go to the target computer you launch any web browser you just give the target the person you want to hack the your ip address so the ip address so then inside our ip our ip address is our server but we have a payload on our server and the payload is in what a folder called payloads so forward payloads then that's it the target computer you just so we're going to need a bit of social engineering the next time we try to um amend this payload change its form into like a pdf a game to make it less suspicious so kill.exe you download it 
so our payload has been downloaded there is it and um we are good to go we just launch it and now we are going to wait for connection so um okay we are in and um the target has been connected so i just do sys info so that's it so that's the info of the system that um, the target computer is using so we've hacked it so as you can see that's my computer so that's the name fail and everything so let's go to our about okay so as you can see that's the info that we got the device name which is fail which is my name okay So now let's run other few commands. Let's run other few commands. So now we're going to run few commands. So um, key scan underscore start. So it says keystroke sniff sniffer has been started. So um, we are going to sniff every key every input so we are going to capture passwords or login info now so that's how hackers steal your passwords so now the target computer is having our payload which is acting as a backdoor for us to access everything he or she does so you can go to any shopping website so binance um is it your bank um your um, um social social media so you just enter your login details sign up details then we would be what watching so be, this is due to you installing um our payload on your computer so it's like um your computer has been what affected by our payload it's now acting serving as a backdoor for us so as you can see fake so let's wait for it so it says dumping so as you can see there you go we're having the password um the email account so as you can see that's in dot gmail i did that so that you know that that's the gmail yes because the target is going to um use it dot gmail dot hotmail yahoo whatever so you're going to know that that's the gmail and the following is going to be the password because you're just going to have either password gmail yeah so as you can see that's it facebook that's it so we've captured your password and everything so let's see that's what we typed yeah that's what we typed so let's um so yeah i can take a screenshot of the device you're using so we just did that and um let's see you see i'm running um chrome on the background and the virtual machine so let's see the virtual machine can be um, a computer outside the targets own so i can be wherever i am and then um, i'll assess your computer i'll see what you're doing whatever you're doing wait to your device so that's it so that's the file that um, we captured so that's the file the screenshot of the target so we're opening it and then we're going to see so that's it so as you can see that's the chrome browser in the background and um, yeah so that's everything so that's facebook there i open facebook and that's a virtual machine so the next that i'm going to show is we can um also have access to what your microphone the device that you're using um i can access it and record everything in your background every sound every audio in your background so i can do that record it so that's it that's the file we can play it i can play that audio to know everything that went on in your background at that time so i can access your mic so that's the audio file as you can see that's the blue file and um finally this um is the most fantastic um the most command that i like accessing your camera or your webcam so i can also do that i can capture you without you noticing it's only if your webcam or camera is having an indicator 
I can just access your camera, capture you, and um, know whatever that you're doing. I watched a movie, was it Mr. Robot? And um, a lady was naked. She bought a CD from a guy. The CD had a pillow on it, um, the back door. Then um, she just set her laptop there, just straight in front of her bathroom. She got undressed naked, and this hacker took a naked picture of this lady. So that's it. I was holding an exercise book, as you can see. Bye.